So my research is all about heavy oil, and specifically the properties of heavy oil, the physical properties and the phase behavior. These are things you need to understand in order to develop efficient processes, operate efficient processes to extract heavy oil and bitumen from the ground. Three major components of my research are oil characterization, phase behavior of heavy oil and solvents, and the physical properties of heavy oil and solvents. And we have specific equipment for each of those areas. So for example, for the phase behavior, we have a PVT cell, which is equipped with a high pressure microscope, which allows us to see these phases as they're forming, and also to measure compositions and other information we need about those phases. Uh, for oil characterization, we've designed an apparatus ourselves that allows us to do distillations at extremely low pressures. But what that does is allow us to distill much more of the heavy oil than has been done before to obtain fractions of that heavy oil, which we can measure properties. Oh, take a look at that. That is so clear. And then the final area would be physical properties. I'll just give you one example, and that would be viscosity, which is probably the most important property for heavy oils. And we actually have a number of apparatus for measuring viscosity, one of which we built in our own lab, and it's a capillary viscometer. And we've used that for lots and lots of measurements and assembled a database that has become very important for developing correlations. I'm also very fortunate to have a lab with $3 million worth of equipment that we've assembled through the years. But with that amount of equipment, we're able to bring a lot of techniques to bear on the research problems we're trying to solve, and we've also assembled a very large database which helps us with any new problem we're trying to address. What we obtain after we perform the distillation with the Grad students are the heart of everything we do here. All our results, all the work, come from the work of the grad students. And what I look for in a grad student we want someone who's creative, someone who's dedicated, who's driven by curiosity, inspired by the research. And for that, you really have to have a sound foundation in the fundamentals, the fundamental sciences, fundamental engineering sciences. If you have the fundamentals and you have a curious mind, you will be a great grad student. In the 16 years I've been doing research, all of my students have gone on to jobs in the industry. I'm very proud of that accomplishment. I think it's not only a testament to the training they've received in my group, but also to the experience they've received here at the Schulich School of Engineering. My research has a lot of indirect benefits for society. Companies use our data and our models to redesign their processes and to develop new processes. This is happening right now, and they will be able to extract oil more economically, in a more environmentally friendly way to sustain an industry that has given a lot of jobs to Canadians.